I don't want to eat this one, please. I'm going to get sick, I'm going to die. I really don't know if I'm going to survive this video. So, in today's video we're going to try Japanese snacks. But also, drinks. I'm afraid of this, this looks like a cleaning product. Let's start with something that I think it would be good, so we start fresh. What do I think it's going to be good? We have squid snack, we have seaweed snack, we have this that looks salty but it has honey in it, so let's start with it. Um, I really don't like when things look like they're salty, but they're actually sweet, because mm, my brain doesn't accept that. It smells old. Actually, it almost smell like nothing, but old. It kind of looks like flakes. Let's start. This is good. Did I like it? Not much. But people will love it. Have you tried churros? Mm, I don't know how to say it in English. Probably there's a different name for it. It's a, a, a Mexican food um, and people really love it. And even here in Brazil, even when I was growing up, people love it. It tastes the same, but without the cinnamon. I don't like it much because, again, I prefer salty. 1 to 10. I'm going to give it a 5, a solid 5, which means... I wouldn't buy it, but with coffee, I would eat it. Okay with me. So, <laughs> um, let's go to a drink, which I think it's going to be good too. And it looks super cute. It's probably going to be good. Sparkly cherry blossom. I hope it doesn't taste like flowers. Because I know the smell. It smells like candy mixed with children medicine. Also, a little bit of, like, children. And it tastes like... Damn! It tastes like sugar with water. It tastes like pink sugar. When things taste pink. Here in Brazil, we have this soda called Jesus Guarana. And it tastes exactly like it. Actually, this is a little bit less sweet. Because the one we have here is, like, pure pink sugar just sweet just sweet by the way i've been sick sick for a while so my body's not acting healthy i'm better now so sugar just makes my mind itchy i i, I don't know how to explain but i feel this itchy sensation when something is really sweety one to ten i'm going to give it a three i think people will like it because people usually like things that taste like sugar but this only tastes like candy sugar. It looks super cute. I would have it just to get something cute in my fridge as decoration. Oh my gosh. Let's go to the seaweed one. By the way, I am allergic to shrimp. I'm allergic to shrimp and I'm going to eat it. This is going to be fun. I, I, actually, the allergy is not that much of a big deal. It's and it tastes like seaweed. Cute. It's going to be delicious. By the way, all the package looks super cute. Also, it expired months ago. <laughs> I don't know if this is the expiration date or if the date it was produced. But considering the rest that I checked, it smells like shrimp. I don't want it. It smells like shrimp and it smells like you that's dry red shrimp. It smells like that. Some people probably love it, but I just can't. Again, looking normal. I don't want to eat this one. Please don't make me do it. Do it, okay. What can I say about it? The first flavor that you feel when you put it in your mouth, it's bad, it's probably the shrimp. But when you start itching, it's super crunchy. And it goes to, not as, I mean, a salty, but also, a little bit spicy flavor that it's actually really good so when you put it in your mouth the taste is i mean people who like shrimp will like it but for me it's just bad um but the extra taste or oh, the taste after you actually bite it's good it hides the shrimp size so to this one incredibly i'm going to give the smell is terrible i'm going to give us 
8.7 because I like the half of the taste because it, it kind of has three tastes at the same time it's like your mouth is feeling overly some things at the same time <sighs> the smell of shrimp is just terrible so let's go <laughs> to another one uh, probably everyone already saw it but I wanted to bring something that I knew it was going to be really good it's basically those spinach chocolate sticks I think they call it pepero or pepero? pepero something like that that it's basically sticks I mean almost like almost like a biscuit um, and covered in chocolate it says it has spinach in it and it has but I tried it before and you can I mean taste the spinach so looking like a big black chocolate bar I'm sorry if you laugh you're going to hell with me don't laugh look for Jesus so let's try I love this one I don't like I prefer savory things or salty things than sweet things but this one is good and the taste is simple with coffee this is amazing um, the chocolate of course at least in this box that I got it's not an expensive chocolate it's just basically basic chocolate um, but and it is sweet, but it's only sweet in the chocolate part. The rest of it doesn't, it's not that sweet. So you can eat with peace because the flavors balance each other. I'm going to give this one. How much do you deserve? Now that you're tiny, I don't know. Don't laugh at it. I'm going to give to this one a nine. Honestly, it doesn't have much of a flavor, but I like this in sweet things. I like sweet things that you can enjoy eating not getting what whole head exploding we did a good one so let's actually this one I, i'm being annoyed i think this one's going to be really good not really good but it's going to be okay so let's eat a squid snack just a quick disclaimer i've never i don't eat any kind of I mean, I don't eat anything that comes from the sea. No fish, no cute animals. And I just don't like it. I just don't like it. I know I don't like many things. It, it's a good smell. I don't know what this smell is, but it's good. I, I, I don't know how to describe it. It's, it's a, a buttery smell, kind of a nuts, buttery, salty smell. It smells good. I don't know how to describe it. And it's just a cute ball aired inside. I think this, this one's going to be good. And thinking about it, you can see like those red marks in it. Are those actually real squids? Let's try. Mm. <laughs> so, it smells like nuts because there is peanuts inside i didn't know this so so the moment you bite it it's like a shell so i i, I when i bought it and i felt that something fell in my tongue i thought it was like a, a part of a squid or something like that but it's like a shell and inside you have like it looks like a peanut but it can be any kind of nut oh it it's not what is that? It looks like peanut, but it tastes like nothing. So this one, this one is great. I mean, here, here. When you break the shell, like the peanut is inside. But actually, probably there's no squid in here, except for the red marks that are probably, that are probably part squids, and these squids are going to kill me for that. Mm. But it tastes good. It tastes good, but when it touch the, the saliva the water just melts in a not good way it's just sticky the after it melts not good so the outside the first flavor you feel it the salty super soft it's almost sweet in the end oh the first taste you feel is actually good salt sweet simple good when you bite it 
The peanut inside tastes like nothing. It doesn't taste like peanuts or any kind of nuts I've tried. It really tastes like nothing. And the aftertaste is just weird and it gets all sticky in your teeth. So I'm going to give a, a four to this. I'm going to give a three to this one. I need a good one. And don't forget, in the end, we are going to have this. Let's try one and that's going to be good. This one's probably going to be great. If there is a cow in it, it's probably just tastes like milk. Have you ever smelled um, the glue people use on their shoes? Like in factories, the, the glue that they use in leather or in shoes. It, it smells like that glue. By the way, people used to use that, I mean, smell that as a drug. People were creative. So, <laughs> it looks almost like a mushroom because it's not totally round. Have you ever heard of dulce de leche? That it's basically in Hispanic, I don't know what country that is from. It's made of milk, sugar, it tastes super sweet and good. I like it. This was supposed to be it, but flavorless, but at the same time, you feel butter. It's, oh, I, I don't know what they did. It was supposed to be made of milk, but they did it with the fat part of the milk. It, actually, it tastes like nothing, but with butter. It's like bu nothing with butter. To this one, I'm going to give a solid three. The nothingness would be a four. But the after butter taste is just... Ugh. Then we go to the, the one I was the most excited about. The most sour flavored candy in the planet. Is it? Probably not. But I can't read... I mean, I can't read Japanese. But this is probably a sour level. And this one is the worst. Another thing about it, it's full of carbs, but no sugar, so sugar-free if you have diabetes. And this lady looks like me when I had my green hair. I was sick this morning. I, I couldn't stand up properly. I'm about better now, so let's... I know, I, I lost a lot of muscles. Don't look at me, please. Also, uh, the expiration date from April and it looks super cute the the, the small package look exactly like the big package not always that's a lie but yes and it looks cute it smells like a cleaning product well it, it smells like a, a cleaning product I'm afraid please don't make me do it do it okay oh, ah! oh the moment it's touch the moment it starts, I, I can't speak. It's like my tongue doesn't want to move anymore. This is the most sour thing that I, I've ever tasted. It's like putting acid in the tongue. I, I'm going to really put it in the mouth and let it stay there. So maybe it dissolves. I, I feel my stomach already. Just by it touching your tongue, it feels like oh, your whole tongue it's burning. When you eat a super sour thing and it, it hurts. Why people do that to them? It's super sour. So I'm going to put it in my mouth for 10 seconds. I don't want it. <laughs> it did burn my tongue. It doesn't stop burning. I can't explain. Jesus. I can't explain, this is not sour, this is acid. The part of my tongue that the ball was, I feel the round shape of a, a tongue burned. When you literally eat a, 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 a food super hot and you forget that it's super hot and you just take it and it burns your tongue and you can feel your tongue after the, the burning feeling, I feel like I burned my tongue. Not only, ah, it hurts. Not only I feel like it burned my tongue, but the flavor keeps coming back. It's not a flavor, it's like a, a burning... It's an acid sensation. It's just acid. It feels like acid. It tastes like acid. If you want to... Oh, I'm going to... 
remember that I was sick? I want to, I, I want to throw up. My stomach just twisted right now. So, so, if you want to make a prank, just give one of those to any of your friends. Saying like, oh, it's sour, but it's soft. I, I want to see you, I want to see you trying. Why people would produce this? I know, I, I, I like sour things. When there is another taste in it, but this one, even with another, it's like the sensation is always coming back. I, I, I'm shaking. <laughs> I have a package full of this shit. If I give it to people, am I going to be a... Jesus, it's like the stomach just wants to do the opposite of living. You know this sour scale? It is right. I would take any pill, any... Madison, you know those one that tastes really bad that they gave children for a reason. I, I would drink that forever instead of ever ever trying this. So this shit for a prank is a fan. I'm probably not going to be able to eat anything today after this because the feeling is always coming back. I've been in hell. This is worse. So to this one, I'm giving a. a Minus fan because I've ate it soap in the past. Don't ask me. I ate it coins when I was a kid by accident. Actually, really. Um, but I I, I prefer chewing a, a, a coin than making it touch my mouth ever again. Let's go to the unholy water. In one side it says water. I can't read Japanese, although it doesn't look much like Japanese. But it was in a Japanese store, so let's believe in it. But in the other side, it kind of looks like it's saying milk. I don't know, probably I'm being too stupid. But it really looks like milk. I want to throw up. Oh my gosh. This is hell. I've been in hell, and this is worse. So, let's try the water that looks like milk, and if it tastes like milk, I'm going to cry. Wait up. It looks like a cleaning product. It smells like a drink that smells like a cleaning product. But it's, it's a good smell. It's a fresh smell. Sweet milk with water. But it's a bit fresh in the middle. Like a, a fresh sensation. But super soft. I thought this one's going to be it was going to be the worst. It's actually one of the best. It smells it is sweet, kind of annoyingly sweet, but it's actually, it's actually good. I, w I would drink it. I mean, after the gym and my mouth just wants something sweet to drink, I would drink it. It's not refreshing because it's sweet, but not too sweet that it stops being refreshing. I'm going to get sick. I'm going to die. I can't anymore. <laughs> please, please. So, so I have more things here. This thing made of rice that I open it and it looks like nails. It's really hard. I don't know how these things can be done in five minutes because it's really hard. And it's basically just that and probably the flavor thing. But I'm going to try it in another video. Also, I have this super spicy noodle that I'm going to try in another video because I'm feeling sick because of, of course I was sick before but I was better, I was okay, I was almost normal again but this thing is terrible, this thing's a crime so that was this video, if you want me to try other foods from other places I liked some things I really hated some things I disliked a lot some other things and I was surprised but by some things um, so that was this video I'm about to throw up and I hope you enjoy it there's going to be more videos trying things that I shouldn't be trying and probably going to do a live trying the super spicy thing and this one so, if 
follow the channel for more, like the video if you like me suffering. I'm not going to eat anything today because I feel like my stomach we're going to reject everything after this super acid things that I just put in my mouth. So that was this video. I hope you enjoyed. Think I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Consider subscribe.